Yeah, if you can do predictions you want, go for it. Go for it. All right, virtual world summoner. Virtual world going first. Here we go. What's the matchup? Virtual world and Emancipator. All right. Hope Emancipator wins. They could. There is a possibility. We'll see. Shout out to all the rocks, yeah. All right, here we go. We're potting, we're potting. No delays, no trouble. We're going. We're going in. Rock out with your block out, exactly. I played Nibiru, does that count? Sure, why not? Come on, boys. Let's go. What are we doing? Virtual worlds. Searching for the Lulu. Okay. Can uh, no side deck Emancipator do anything against full setup virtual world? I don't think so. I'm gonna say no. <laughs> oh man. Nibiru in hand? I don't think Nibiru is gonna matter. We'll see though. We will see. No side deck. Getting in there. Zoom so patiently looks through his cards. Okay, there we go. Quay long. Channel bit tells us too many non believers. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Okay. Sign up, sign up, sign up. What icon do you use? Oh, I don't remember. I don't even know what icons I have. I should probably check. Okay. Now what? Now we search. Okay. Noom so taking his sweet time with his plays, I see. <laughs> okay. He's thinking, man. What can I say? Thinking out all the possible lines of play and what he wants to do. Okay. Stardust Charge Warrior for the draw card. Went for a hot dog? Yeah. Play on a Master Duel mobile phone, dude. You get you get delay after everything. 
What can you do? Stall? Nah, he's just thinking about his plays. Oh. Okay. Necros feels tier one. What the hell? Alright, boys, let's get in there. Alright, let's see. Researcher. Whoa, that was quick. Alright, we're caught up. We're caught up. We're in there. We're in there. I guess we'll see tomorrow. I think there's another Duel Links tournament tomorrow. But uh, they didn't even top, so I don't think so. Maybe everyone, maybe everyone got bored. They put away their Phantom Knight decks, you know? Alright, alright. Big Mech, Big Mech, Tenyu, Researcher. Okay. It won a tournament? Which one? Give me the name. I want Deets right now. I'm gonna look it up. AU Weekly. I don't see it. Where? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I don't see it. I see Battle Phase 375. And that's it. Did it actually have 16 players? Nah, no shot. AU Weekly. I think you're making this up. I think your uh, your copium's gone too much to your head. I think this is fake news. I don't see it on the website. On DuelLinksMeta.com. It must have not happened. Does DDD have their Pendulum Monster in Duel Links? I don't know. Prank Kid Package? Hell yeah, brother. Prank Kid Emancipator. We on Necros Copium again? Hey, it is what it is, man. You know? It is what it is. Necros will be good one day. I believe. Psych. Alright. Full board. Here we go. No hand traps. This is GG's again? GG's again? No hand traps? No maidens? I mean, he doesn't have a negate up, actually. You could... <laughs> he could get to be rude. Probably not, though. Appalusi. Now we're negating monster effects. We're good. We're good. We're good. They won one game in Duel Links Team War. Yeah. Okay. Emancipator Ryzen. I mean, I don't really blame anyone for thinking decks are good in that game. There's, like, no tournaments anymore. You get, like... You get, like... One to two competitive tournaments a week, and the rest have like less than a hundred players. It is what it is. So I'm sure I'm sure you get a lot of false positives on deck rights decks right now for anything else that's being played. This deck's the only one that plays the twit prank kid package. Well, prank kids play them too, right? Come on now. Can't think of prank. Can't can't forget the prank kids. So there is delay now, but it's too late. Apollosa is now on the board. Apollosa would just negate anything that comes out, and I think that's a GG. It's not on DLM because it's not big enough money reward wise. Oof, you hate to see it. Why'd you link me to a Discord? What the hell is this? <laughs> I can't click that. Just send me a picture of like the breakdown, or was there only like 50 players? If it's fi if it's less than 100 players, I, I that that's not a real tournament. I'm sorry. They haven't they haven't they haven't they haven't won a real tournament yet. I mean, hell, even our battle phase that isn't streamed still somehow managed 140 players. So unless we're reaching the unless we're, we got at least 100 players. They have not won a tournament yet. <laughs> what the hell? If our non-stream tournament still gets 140 people, I still expect at least 100 players to show up. Otherwise, uh, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's, it's abhorrent data, right? Abhorrent data. Data that's so far out 
the 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 normal spectrum, you shouldn't take it into statistics. I wasn't battle phase streamed. Why would I stream battle phase? Now mission find a hundred Necros players. <laughs> yeah, just have all all hundred of them uh, duel out for it. Yo, Necros is like expensive now, isn't it? You gotta buy the new box. You gotta buy the box that just came out, and then you gotta go back and get Kaleidoscope. That's actually kind of insane. What the fuck? That is way too much. Union Carrier. Is he just gonna... <laughs> Yo, look at this toxic board, dude. Apollosa, Savage Boar Load, and we're locking you out of the extra. Fuck. It's not even like a crazy Emancipator board. It's just like... A board. Okay. Not too much you can craft the cards you need. Oh, man. Don't say that, bro. All right. Well, I uh, I think that's it. Yeah. Both of these decks have extremely powerful turn ones, and I don't think either of them can break their tier ones going tier two. Turn two. We'll see, though. We'll give him the benefit of the doubt. Emergency teleport. Will he blow the Savage Boar Load on this? Probably a no. Maybe a yes. We'll see. Okay. Necros won a tournament with 80 players joined after DQ. Yeah, that's Garbo in that's Garbo information. I'm sorry. I'm sorry it breaks your heart, Murata, but we had a 144 player tournament after DQs and they didn't top. So I think you can call that a real tournament. No, we had 140. <laughs> you the Duel Links tournaments can still get player numbers. There's still individual people playing. I don't think we just changed the rules all of a sudden. Unless that changes. But 140 people for a non-streamed event? And it doesn't top at all? I think that's better data than it just won an 80-person tournament. What do you classify a real tournament? At least 100. At least 100. Anything under 100, I'm going to say no. That's a meme. It's a may may. Has to at least be 100 players. Actual 100 real players. Anything underneath that? I mean, that's 20 whole players are missing, man. That's 20 whole, 20 whole Phantom Knight decks, you know? That's weird. You're weird. Summoner! Researcher. Oh man, these mills. <laughs> All right, we got the researcher at least. Researcher and the prank kid could be pretty good. Stop the copium. It's okay. It's okay. People just let people enjoy. Let people waste money. Enjoy whatever decks they want, and then in a week they'll complain about the deck being weak, and then they'll be next box will be good, and then that box will be trash, and then they'll say it's good, and then it's bad, and then eventually, eventually we'll have link summons and dual links. And then there'll be no more excuses for bad decks. And then finally, we can get a good, a good box. Copium. We have to add bots like casual tool? <laughs> yeah. 20 whole PK decks, that's really what's missing, right? In real life, it's hard to near 100 people. Yeah, but we're not real life, though. We're the internet, and the internet, it's very easy to connect across the world, right? You're not just, you know, you live in the United States, you have the United States. You know? At the end of the day, it's, it should be extremely easy. Alright, huge board, lethal, incoming, GG's. But yeah, you guys can like whatever you like, I'm just saying. Me, personally, I don't think winning an 80-person tournament makes you a good deck. I think the that's just a low population tournament even if that was one of my tournaments i would have said the same thing like yeah only 80 people that's just not enough to say so and so is good i would say not topping at all in a 140 person tournament is much more 
like clear data over a deck strength. If that hurts your feelings, I really don't give a shit, right? I'm just I'm just stating pure facts, you know. Why is there a Pepe Law so fucked? That's why it's funny? Is that why? That's the intention? Bro, no way. Pepe Law looks normal on Discord. Hold on. Pepe Law. Yeah. It looks normal on Discord. I have I have Pepe Laugh though. That looks way more fucked up. If I'm being honest. It's the Pepe Law you see when you're drunk. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just saying we could have a more HD version of Pepe Law, boys. Come on. Apparently everyone likes it, so I don't know. <laughs> oh, man. Imagine having a Duel Links tournament. We have one every week. We have uh, one every Monday. We have a Duel Links tournament. As far as I know, it's the Duel Links tournament that gets, like, the most players every week. Free to enter. It was, like, 140-something players last week. It was actually kind of crazy. Probably helped that a new box literally came out as the tournament happened. And then every other week, we have uh, GG Tour, where I stream the uh, the top cut for the, uh, the, the winning decks. So at this point, unless a deck actually tops, I just don't even pay attention to it. You know? Brick Worlds, let's go. True. Emancipators taking their shot here. Let's do it. Let's do it to it. Last game. Whoever wins here will take the dub. GG's. Block Dragon Detected, of course. Naturally, dude. My jimmies. <laughs> we'll see. Unfortunate Brick Man. It, it is it is very, very irritating. I will say very irritating to be in a best of three situation, win like the first game, so you should have the advantage game three, and you've been doing very well all tournament. Because this is single elimination, remember chat? This is single elim, so if this ever happened during the tournament, he'd be out of the tournament, right? To get through the entire tournament, make it to the very last goddamn duel, and then brick is not a good feeling, right? Like that that is not a good feeling. What's no matter who you is. Make Axis code win. We'll see. He is getting a lot of draws on this Max C. We know we've seen Umso play the uh the big boy Nibiru. But we'll see, we'll see. Sounds like Noble Knight and Duel Links, yeah. He can draw Nibiru, pretty much. He needs to set up a negate before Nibiru shows up. Nightmare Phoenix to clear the back row. Yo, okay. Got some delay. DLE delay. There goes Chuche. Draw a card. How much damage are we at? Four, five, not much. Oh, wait a second. Hold on. Wait. Nah, I ain't good at math. But, uh, oh, okay. Never mind. <laughs> I thought that was going to end on that. There's Appalosa. Well, I guess whatever's been triggering in the hand will no longer be triggering, probably. Block a dragon, lets him add three. That's so many cards in the goddamn hand, dude. Holy shit. It's it's a really good thing this is turn two. Because holy shit, could you imagine this is all happening on turn one? Oh my lordy. Appalosa. Can now negate up to three monster or three monster effects from the hand. How many hand traps we drawing? 13 cards left in the deck after that banishment, ladies and gentlemen. Look at this. Just deck him out for it. 
Imperm Nibiru? Hmm, maybe. The thing is, though, he's eventually going to put up more shit, right? Okay, there's Nibiru. Nibiru is going to get apollosa Is there anything to follow up? There is Psy Frame Lord Gamma will be negating the Apollosa. That is not something you could like call by, for example, because it comes from the hand, does not go to the graveyard as cost. So that will be destroying Apollosa, and that Nibiru will go through. Okay. Let's see if you can continue. Can't Apo negate twice? Not per chain. Once per chain. Not in the same chain link. Okay, okay, okay. Here comes Nibiru. Yeah, Dolka. Dolka's nuts. Alright, we got a big old Nibiru token. 43 hundo defense points here. Uh, supplier comes out. I mean, this is a lot of cards for Umso, right? So... Damn. Should he really have played this aggressively? There's the Kwaki Guardian. That would have been nice. <laughs> that, would, that would have been nice way earlier, bro. Holy shit. Hey, that Guardian could have been nice way earlier. It is a little too late for that one. Let's see. Link Spider comes out with the Nibiru token. Good old Nibiru A. How many hand traps is he going to grab? Nine cards left in the deck. Nine deck out win? I don't think he's going to be able to summon nine more cards. I guess ten more cards. Oh, no. Nine and then past her. Yeah, yeah. Nine more cards. I don't think he's summoning nine cards. All right, let's see. Union Carrier shows up. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, banish for Block Dragon. I mean, he's trying. Don't get me wrong, he's trying. Bro, if he actually decked him out, that'd be hilarious. I don't think he's gonna be able to do it, though. Look at this. He has to fucking scroll his hand right now. When your hand's doing this, you know you've got game, right? All right, what are we equipping? We're equipping either an Earth or a Rock. Okay, I will equip my Block Dragon with a Block Dragon. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't see a way Umso loses this, bro. He has his entire fucking deck in his hand, right? Like, come on, ain't no way he loses this, dude. <laughs> Literally, just whatever, whatever board he wants to make, whatever board he's possible making, it's coming. It's coming. That is a huge hand. Look at this shit. Look at this. God damn. I believe he doesn't run Unicorn. Block Dragon cannot be destroyed by card effect. But uh doesn't matter. I'm so big pee pee. Yeah, he's got his whole deck in his hand, dude. You guys, uh, it's like that meme, the, the Uno meme with the... Uh, you know fucking go for lethal or draw your whole deck go plus 25 all right let's go you might have drawn enough cards where you can't activate virtual world cards i think even with even even if that's the case i don't think i don't think that will cause him to lose we'll see Yeah, he's chilling, dude. Alright. Alright, alright, alright. 
Summoner in defense. We create any board. Who, oh, what the hell? Quick little delay over there. Okay. A Nibiru of his own. Okay. Is this Hopium? I mean, he definitely... Ha oh, oh, maybe not. Hold on. Wait a second. The Nibiru Wars? Bro. Okay. That token is massive, dude. 98 hundo defense. Okay. Now, maybe? Maybe? Let's see. Does he have anything else? He does need another virtual world now. But he got into B-Rude. Oh, shit. There's still something? Oh, it's Block Dragon. Never mind. <laughs> That's a say. We don't know what Union Carrier does. What did Union Carrier do? Did it do anything special? Equip a target. You cannot special summon monsters from the equipped card's name for the rest of this turn. Block Dragon? Wait, what? Did I miss something? They said he can make Unicorn, but you can't use it as a Link Material to turn its summon. I'm, wait, I'm so confused. What about Unicorn? You mean the Block Dragon? That's what I was equipped. Numerons can't even attack over that token. What the? To deck him out? Oh, to deck him out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think they meant more for the Unicorn for the Block Dragon since it couldn't be destroyed. That's how I took it. I thought you meant this turn. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> I don't think Union Carrier is doing anything. Triple. Oh, wow. Yeah, that Nibiru stopped him. Now we're in an interesting position, right? The Virtual World needs another Virtual World card, either Normal Summoned or E-Teleported or something to make plays. Uh, five cards left. We'll see what happens. Hey, Nibiru is tough, man. Now, though, that's a 12,000 token you need to stop. <laughs> Was he not have Zenglong? Ganglong? I think he did. He sent it away earlier. It's right here. He used it way, way earlier. Quing Long is, uh... Long gone. How do I stop him with so many cards in hand? His deck just doesn't... Uh, like, it, 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 virtual worlds need another virtual world on the board to summon themselves, right? So if you don't have a virtual world monster to summon yourself with, it doesn't really help you. Damn, he's dropping all the max C's, the pot of desires. Fuck, all that advantage gone, another pot of desires. Yeah, that Nibiru fucked him. He would have been fine. He would have been able to create a board. But after a Nibiru? Nah, man. Let's see if he can recover. I don't know about this. This is this is a this is a toughie. Oh my god. Oh no, but his opponent has literally nothing. It's gonna come down to can he draw out the entirety of his deck, or can this token fucking beat past set cards? Holy, we have uh, we have gone into an interesting board state here, a game state, if you will. This is uh, <laughs> not good. Chuche is Chuche live? It is live. It's got a pop ready. So you can pop something. Magic cylinder brought chill. Oh man. <laughs> okay. Didn't flip Chuche. This would be the first time he could. He said it last turn. Why the maxi challenge goes wrong, but right? It's this is a weird maxi challenge because neither player is in an, a, a great situation here. 
Chuche now on the board. There's the virtual card he needed to use his other virtual cards. And it looks like Umso is going to be able to come out on top here. Unless that back row is huge. <laughs> imagine Magic Soldier. Bro, ain't... <laughs> no, I don't want to imagine Magic Soldier. Oh, God. Okay. Goes in, tunes with the Ash Bosom. Break Sword comes out. What is that back row, bro? I mean, it can't be anything good, can it? Probably like a call by or something. Let's see. Analog. Send to Beer. Yeah, card. average gamer guy. Thanks for nine months, bro. Take back. It Switch was forbidden droplet. Ooh. All right, boys. I think that's gonna be it. Forbidden Dropletto. I think that might be it, boys and girls. Chuche is still alive. And that token will one-shot him at 12,000 attack. Nibiru, even though it has 3,000 attack, has 600 defense. So, uh... Oh, yeah. It's over. GG. That is gonna be game, ladies and gentlemen. Virtual World will be your GG Tour Champion! Spin back the card to the hand. Swing, swing, swing into the token. Open board! And that's gonna be it. <laughs> Pop Nibiru, he could. He's about to, you're about to get Luya. Bro, losing to your own Nibiru token has to feel like the worst, right? Like, there's no way.